Hi guys, just doing my video recording for um, week two of Amy's soap challenge from um, Great Cake Soap Works. And this isn't it right here. Uh, I just have a little story to tell about soap molds and then I'll show you my screw up. Anyway, um, soap molds usually like these little ones, your design that you're going to show are actually in the very bottom of the bottom of the mold not the very top and all the ones I have are that way so when you pop it out you're actually using the bottom of the soap mold like say in that soap right there it's the bottom half not the top because the top doesn't look so nice but I didn't think about that when um, I did my milk soap so I did a coconut milk soap it was the one only one that I hadn't really used it. I used um, buttermilk in most of my soaps or yogurt or goat's milk. So I used coconut. <laughs> and I was going to do um, musical notes for my friend. Her birthday's today. And I wanted to have this soap done and do a musical note soap. So um, I ordered a mold and got it in and made the musical notes. And the first time I made them, they came out gray. And so I wasn't going to use those, so I, then that, that was another day it was going to take me. And so the next day, I made some more, and they turned out black. And then I had to wait another day for those to unmold and then put them in the soap. And I didn't even think about um, what it was going to look like. And so here's the mold. This is my little mold I'd been waiting on and got it in and thought it was so so cute not thinking about it at all and this is why you also don't soap when you're tired or in a hurry because you don't think about things um, and so I made them and they came out pretty good just the the one with the two notes together broke but other than that they were okay and I smacked them in my soap and called it good and kept looking at them and thinking that it <laughs> looked really funny and I didn't know why um, until like three days later all of a sudden it dawned on me that in this soap mold you cannot switch the soap around and use the what's going to be the perfect side that's in the bottom of the mold because then your notes are going to be backwards but at the time I was in a hurry and tired and um, yeah I didn't think that through <laughs> and so I have 15 freaking bars of soap that have backwards notes in them and I'm so bummed because I was going to give it to my friend today like give her like three or four of them and, and she likes to display the soaps and stuff and so here's my screw up soap not that one that one's good but there's my screw up soaps I made it in a drawer and it made 15 bars I think but the notes are backwards I didn't even I didn't even think about it. I just plunked those babies in and was using the the good side, not even thinking about it, just always doing what I always do. And so there's the, I did go ahead and use the lighter colored ones, figuring maybe I could steam them up or something and they'd darken a little bit. But anyway, that's my craptastic soap. I screwed it up and then I did, it's, I don't know, I did part part black on the bottom and then the white and little stars and there's all different kinds but I think what I could do I can't just turn them around and make them base notes that isn't gonna work I'm gonna see if I can get them out of there and if I can get them out um, then I'm going to make another batch of soap I might be able to do it tonight I don't know I have more clients to see yet but um, if I can take it out of there and then make another batch and pipe on the top and then plop it on the top and then maybe cut the bars in half because they're huge they're ginormous bars of soap so um, I'm hoping maybe that would work and then they'd just be a taller bar instead of a big square bar I don't know I'm so bummed oh, this was like 
four days in the making and every time I just screwed it up. I should have just left it alone and not bothered with it. But I really wanted to make this up for my friend to have for her birthday because she's a, a piano teacher and loves music and everything. And she would love these. Anyway, yeah, I'll try to make them good. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.